The former aide of the late president, Daniel Arap Moy, that is Jose Kiplagat, has been eulogized as a respectful, humble and industrious man for the years he served under the retired president. Kiplagat died on Saturday at Karen Hospital after a meeting with his friends in one of the restaurants in Nairobi. Ruth Sarmoy has the details. Heydays, Jose Kiplagat was one of the most powerful figures around the late President Daniel Arap Moi, juggling between the role of advisor to the president to his pointman in Baringo. His death shocked his home, Tenges Ward, in Baringo Central. The latest uh, is like uh, some three days ago. Kulikuwa na familia walikuwa mepata walikuwa wamepata changa kama walikuwa wamepoteza mtu na mzee alitumana pesa kwa hiyo jamii so hata kueleza jamii kwamba ule mzee alitusaidia ndio tuweze kufanya kazi ile tulifanya juzi au amini Kiplagat was born in 1945 in Kiplabal village in Baringo County. His first job was a prison warder before he resigned and ventured into business where his success connected him to former President Moi. During Moi's regime, Kiplagat warmed his way into his inner circle, serving as his advisor while remaining an ardent businessman. Local leaders, though in mourning, celebrated the humility and life of a man who had the ear and trust of former President Moi. Keblagat is a household name in Baringo, and I want to take this opportunity to pass my sincere and heartfelt condolences to the family, his wife, Mrs. Helen Keblagat, and the children uh, on the sudden death of Osea Keblagat who is a great leader. He has um, been a pillar. He has been a development conscious person. And um, he has been a man who is a people's person, uh, somebody who loves development, somebody who likes and to encourage his people. I remember when we were young in school, he used to come and encourage us. And by that time, he was one of the top leaders of, of this county. Other leaders, including Deputy President William Ruto and Waipa leader Kalonzo Musioka, sent their condolence message to the family of the deceased. Kiplagat resigned in 2003 as the chairperson of the Cooperative Bank after serving for 10 years. He unsuccessfully vied for the Baringo Central Parliamentary seat in 2007 and 2013. He will be remembered as one of the longest serving Kanu chairperson for Baringo. Earlier this month, the High Court withdrew a restraining order on the Bank of India that threatened to auction his palatial home in Karen, among other properties, over a 378 million shilling defaulted debt. 76 year Kiplagat has left behind two wives and seven children. Ruth Sarmui and TV.